Everybody has their own way of making Yorkshire pudding. I think it should be served with any roast, personally. I think it's fantastic. On its own, fantastic, no problem at all. And I do speak for some experience. My grandmother came from Yorkshire but moved to Lancashire, so she's actually sort of oh. crossed the road. I met my, my, my granddad. But this was her recipe. Oh, it's no. very, very simple. Four medium eggs. Okay, got a few basic rules. Four medium eggs at room temperature. It makes a big difference. Why? Because if at room temperature, when they go in the oven, they, they start cooking quicker. Okay. And the whole point is you need to get some lift into them. So room temperature is, is really important. Then I add normal plain flour. So this is it. So four eggs, you add half the flour. So four eggs, 225 grams of plain flour, not bread flour, mm. normal plain flour, one pint of milk, five, six, eight mils of milk. And you put half the milk in. Right. Okay. And then just literally, if you start from the centre and break up the eggs, and you'll see that the eggs start to work nicely, the flour rolls in on itself, and when you get to there, you'll see there's a few lumps, but the point being is that when you get to that point there, add the rest of the flour, okay, and then you can beat the lumps out. If you add all the milk, there's too much liquid and you will never get the lumps out. So you just keep whisking it. Don't go mad. So it's all falling in. Until like. you beat the lumps out of it. Yeah, and then you just literally, at this point here, whisk, whisk, whisk. You'll see the lumps coming out. If there are a few, like that. Disappearing before our very Look at that, see? Yeah. 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 Then you add the rest of the milk. In it goes and you make up your batter. Now, the other thing to say is, I always season my Yorkshire puddings at the last second. Now, salt tightens the protein of egg white. If you're making salmon mousse, put salmon in, egg whites, put this, and whiz it up. Put the salt in, it completely tightens up. So I always add the salt. So that's a good thing? That's a good thing. Right. It, it does certainly help for the structure at the end. Now, but there you don't go. put pepper in. You can if you want. Uh, to be honest with you, would you really notice the difference? Uh, probably not. Right, now in this oven here, which is set at 225 degrees, sorry, 200 degrees centigrade, I've got a tray. Yeah. It has two tablespoons of oil in each one. Keep the oven shut. Any particular oil? That you Any oil will do. Right. And then, what you need to do, I'm just going to pull this into here, like so. Can I ask a question? Which people can. say it's about the oil, it has to be smoking hot. Yes, it does. Do so when I pull that in, you'll see, let's see that. Mm. They keep going, these are muffin tins, so you get a slightly deeper Yorkshire pudding. That has to be hot, so that starts to cook straight away. See that? Yeah. And by the time you get to the end, that should just have stopped bubbling. So we're a bit short of time, so I'm just going yeah. to keep going very, very quickly Same old here. story with you, hasn't uh, it? Yeah, <laughs> it's short of time. Yeah, well, <laughs> who is it who runs over? Uh, 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 no, it might be a certain Mr Holmes. Uh, Every week it's the same. Uh, right, 200 degrees. That goes back in. OK, at this point here, you whack that in there very carefully on a tray so you keep as much heat in yeah. as possible. You give that 10 minutes yeah. right. and you turn it down to 180 and leave it for 45 minutes. What? Oh, so you do it on the high heat yeah. for 10 minutes. Yeah, initial lift. Turn it down. Turn it down and that, they'll start to rise and that, that heat then will just cook them through. The golden rule is when they get to around about 40 minutes, you think take them out of the oven, don't. Mm -hmm. Give them 10 minutes extra and they won't collapse. So you're doing Mm -hmm. An hour altogether. Yeah. Just under an hour. But, but so, some ovens cook quicker than others. But the golden rule is: do not take them out. Give them ten minutes extra, and they will not collapse. 